Previously on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Baby, you gotta see this. Here, Clem. Want some uh, batteries? Can we at least look for my parents when we get there? They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. If this was me, asking you for help, would you be there for me? I need your help, please. I'm sorry, but you're on your own on this one. I swear, before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! <coughs> Clementine, are, are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Cody! Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine, but if I were you... I choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't the kidnapping, Lee. Then what is it? A rescue. Better not fucking hurt her. I swear. This is bad, but we can deal with it together. We're going to need to hurry. How's that feeling? It doesn't matter. Is what it is. We don't have a lot of time. We're about to have a lot less. We three will stop them getting in. Lee, find a way out of here.
looks like a car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Just some surgical supplies. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. You got any better ideas? Okay, it's now or never. Stop! He's awake! He's awake! He's bitten. We've still got to do something. Do we have to cut it off, though? We're trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. But this way? Do we know it works? Of course not. Is there gonna be a lot of blood? There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine, and get the hell out of Savannah. If there's any chance this saves his life, we have to take it. Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here without a lot of options. Fuck it. Cut it off. Seriously? Yeah. I'll go as fast as I can. Fast would be good. Look, you're- <laughs> Try to stay still! <laughs> Just hold on! Getting to the point where we figured you weren't coming back. Oh, what the hell did we do? Oh, uh, Jesus, this hurts so goddamn bad. I hope it helps. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. Yeah. The elevator's open, let's go! I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed on anyone. jeez. Oh, We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible, and see if we can make it to an empty floor, or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Get going. No way. 
way. Jesus Christ, Lee. Ah! Wasn't this city empty not too long ago? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There's thousands. Did they follow us here? It seems like it, but that can't be, can it? That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. What about the train? What about the train? It wasn't quiet. You think it could have brought them all to us? Maybe we can wait for an opening. I don't know. We could be waiting a long time. We're probably just going to have to pick our time and go. The longer we're up here, the further Clementine could be getting from us. We should probably start back at the mansion then, right? Which way is that? It's between us and River Street, so we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards the hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Sounds good. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I, uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. Omid's right. If you see yourself getting woozy or, you know, if it didn't work, just take it easy. And it wasn't my favorite hand anyway. Really? Without old Lefty, I'd be done for. Shut up, Omid. Seriously, though. Don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, we do. Now what? We need to get down there and find a scared little girl. Let's try to get our bearings. It's an extension ladder. Looks like Crawford Square over there. That looks like Crawford Square over there. See anything? There's a fire escape here, and that's about it. If we get over to that bell tower, we might have some impact on all those walkers out there. But then we just run through the streets? I don't know. What do you think? I think I'm staring down at my worst nightmare. Just a dusty haze of death. Try to keep your shit together. We need to get off this roof. Uh. 
You need a hand with that? I got it. Damn it. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You shouldn't be the one to go. My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. It should be able to get me across the gap. I don't like anything about this. It'll take two seconds. Maybe we should have someone more able-bodied doing that. You sure you're up for it, Lee? Say that again and you're gonna find out. Fair enough. I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit. Try to find another way out of there? It's locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked! Few solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. way tons of them jesus now get back here i think i have to jump there's no way back fuck be careful i'm so fucked I believe in you! Nice. Now let's get the hell out of here.
Fingers! What the f- They fucked us! What? Who? Vernon. He didn't have Clem. So where the fuck is she? With someone else. We're going after her. Fuck. Just... Jesus! Wait, the cancer patients did this? Yeah, they were waiting. Tired of living underground, I guess. They kicked the shit out of me and tossed me in here. Wait, what the hell happened to you? Cut it off. Seriously? Yeah. I lived through it, which is a start. And, well, uh... I thought it might save my life. I was lucky to get bit down on the wrist, far from anything important. But who knows? Jesus. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Get to the countryside. You dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten and God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows, and we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katya and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. Oh, Ben, I'm... Oh, oh shit, here they come, in the house. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Ben. Go upstairs. And do what? Just go. Omi. What is it? Everyone, help Omid now! Lee, help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Take their goddamn arms off! 
Get ready to fight. This place seems sturdy to me. I think we're fine. Sturdy my ass! Get upstairs! Go! Guys, help me with this! Everyone get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This will slow him down. Get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stand. Can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. Y'all know where to aim. Get ready. Here, um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right, we gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent III. Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. Can't we fight our way back through the house? I've got a weapon. What else do we have? Not much. It'll be a goddamn mess going back down there. I'll go. We're no good to Clementine dead. <coughs> hey. You're not looking great. And you're warm. I'm okay. Don't... What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Stop it! We can't panic! Do you think that worked? I... I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. 
I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. You're not touching me. Do you understand that? You know exactly what to do if I turn and that's enough. Do you hear me? You might become one of them! You understand that? How can you be fucking calm about that? You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well... They probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I was. The fucking thing, it, it happened so fast. You ever almost hit someone in a crosswalk? Almost? His license was suspended. Twice. Just wham! The thing was on me. Never saw it. Like someone in your blind spot. So weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone, too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We make sure he never takes anybody from anyone again. World's got enough evil in it. And, you know, whatever happens to you, uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off! What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to me. It's what I want, okay? What about him? What do you two think? He's a risk to the group, but... I feel bad for him. Yeah, I feel bad for him too. He loses shit like that often? No, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit off. Kenny's been horrible to her. He blames Ben for his family's death, and it's just more complicated than that. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. 
Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, hun. You can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? I can handle it. Pain, that is. I'm just really goddamn tired. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? I feel like a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just... fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be alright, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard it outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. It's all water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well, cheers. I'm through! No walkers. Things are looking up. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well... Smart. Think of all the people we've seen go. They got to do it their own way. Together. Don't you say that. You stick it out as long as you can. You do whatever you have to. I could have done more. We all could have done more. Myself included. I could have been a better husband. Better father could have been a better friend. So let's figure out a way out of here. Get that little girl. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed.
Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go ahead. Fucking mouth. Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? Stay up here. Keep an eye out. Okay, but I can't see much from up here. Just let us know if they start coming down the alley. We'll be back. Be careful. Okay! I'm okay. Just get me out of here. Are you okay? What the fuck happened, Ben? I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. We're gonna get your ass up. Really? I thought you... Fucking hell. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. We can get you up. We can, uh... Ow! Oh, God. If he'd be quiet, then maybe. But Kenny, this is fucking serious. He could die just by moving him wrong. I won't move! Ben! Fuck! Fuck! Oh god, don't let them get to me! Do you have any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back. She needs you, Lee. Kenny! This is not a discussion! Hell no, man! I'm not leaving! What did I just say? Let's get Ben and get out of here! Fuck, Kitty! Lee, Lee, it's okay. No, kid! No, it's not! It's just something I gotta do. You know that. Go get that girl! Back, you sons of bitches! Yeah! <laughs> Damn it, Kenny! Oh, fuck! Kenny! God damn it! What happened?
had to help. What the fuck happened? There was just too many of them. Ben was really messed up and... I don't know. There's nothing else. God damn! God! I heard a shot. He was fighting them off. Trying to, at least. It... <sighs> you saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry, Lee. Well, maybe he did get away. I don't know. We should go. Right behind you. 